Interesting note that he is using V-Trigger 2 as opposed to V-Trigger 1. Yeah. So maybe uh, something about V-Trigger 2 in this matchup is important for KDA. We haven't seen it use Psycho Crusher as of yet. Yeah, it, it's got to be something in this matchup, but I just don't I don't know what. Like, what is it that you want to use? Interesting, he's really looking for that counter hit. Right. Nice. Gets caught going for a throw. Geki with the Geki reaction. Classic. Yeah. Okay. That's minus one. Did you know that? Which? Heavy kick? Really? Isn't that brutal? <laughs> yeah, a little bit. All right. So there is a setup with... Oh, interesting. Okay, so there is a setup with uh, use of uh, the Cycle Flame yep. to get the second hit, regardless of if you're blocking or it's not, so from Cycle Crusher silly. to cross yeah, up. Yeah, it's... Yeah. I Like, it makes sense. It's just the fact that it works. Yeah. Oh, oh Allegri ass on the side of PB Geki. It. One, two, and three. Get the check? job done. You're talking about minus one heavy kick. Yes, thank you. <laughs> um, yeah, so it's the way that that works is that the hit's done. Um, so every single time you get a hit applied to you or you block something, yeah. that hit stun is what's currently in effect, yeah. right? And so the hits, because the hits of the cycle flame are so kind of spaced out, yeah. that and you cancel into the cycle or the you you cancel the cycle flame into the crusher, yeah. and because of that, the just so happens that the hit stun on the um, the flame is so little that the next hit that happens to hit. Yeah. It's really dumb. Yeah, it's, it's it absolutely is, it's dumb. Really I actually dumb. tweeted about that because I was recovering from injury and I decided to play. And then uh, I came across a bison and there was a, there was a, oh my god. Right? Yeah, okay. <laughs> so anyways, um, as we were talking about bison doing some crazy bison things, we did not get to see bison do anything crazy. No, that PB, was all Geki. That was definitely all PB Geki. Tournament experience will play a factor now. Um, we have to take into consideration that KDA could possibly be mentally exhausted from playing against Zero. True that. I am interested. Maybe he thought there was something that he could do with this matchup, where, yeah. but it just isn't working. Yeah. Or so it didn't get to do anything. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, I do think Ed would be a better matchup here. Yeah. Um, it would be tough to deal with Geki's um, with Vega's move speed. I find is like his probably his strongest point. Not even like his you know. Get out, oh, are you? Let's do it. Let's let's do it. Okay, I Can I just talk about how this matchup is garbage for, for like yeah. Alex? Yeah. This is awful. But he must see something in it. He wants to try something for sure. I think he sees those neutral jumps and he thinks that he can deal with them better with Alex, or he's more used to dealing with them. Yeah. Um, because honestly, that kind of was what killed him was the text and the the shaman. Yeah. yeah. So let's see. Look. If he pulls this back, yeah. I'm gonna. Yeah, he's on the anti here. All right, so good. he's mistimed his meaty early. You're seeing this is the this is what we call the uh, the issue with playing multiple characters is that sometimes uh, your muscle memory is not there for the the character that you select moving forward, and you're still sort of going with the character that you had in the past. And oh, uh, we saw a mistimed meaty. Oh, the crush counter from Geki. He's gonna find a whole ton of damage here. Good confirm. Or good, like co combo, I guess. Oh, the, yes, I love it. I love it so much. Oh, he's gonna dash up through again. Oh, he went through. <laughs> Tried to. Yeah. Oh, he fully, tr almost fully tries that Lariat. Unfortunate spacing. Do not jump on v Vega when V Trigger is active. It is very, very hard. It's, it's one of those things. Uh, it comes down to matchup knowledge. I don't know how many Vega plays KDA plays normally. Mostly an online warrior, so you're not going to see that many aside from Geki if you are in that area. But as far as I know, um, KDA is still sitting in the vicinity of uh, Super Ultra Platinum. So he might not be seeing as many Vega plays. Ooh, I like that. I like that try. I really do. Right. Uh, good block from Geki. Safe jump set up for Geki. Gonna land the ASE. Take a throw. Threatening stun now the other way. Nice confirm. That hit uh, and confirm. Will he find the end of it? Nope. He's gonna go for the setup. So yeah. That not only he's gonna land. Yeah, he will. I mean, he would have landed on the other side. Yeah, it's really crazy. If that was blocked, KDA would have been uh, facing the wrong way. It was a very, very tricky setup here. Uh, that looked like matchup knowledge problems for KDA. Although it might not actually cross up because Alex's hurt box is actually too wide. Yeah.